Hey, what up, YouTube? I just got this uh, Alpine Stars Jaws leather jacket. It's a perforated version. Matches the boots nicely. It's got the 360 zip. It's got the internal vest liner, which makes it a little bit more bulky than jackets without the internal liner. Still a nice fit. It's a 48 US, 58 Euro. I know on the videos they gave reviews, but I'm not saying I have the biggest arms, but you do have to be careful because if you do have a decently sized arm, it's kind of tight. In the back, it feels good, but the arms are kind of tight. I know the leather will stretch a little. It's not unbearable. Um, show you a little bit of the inside. I haven't ridden with it yet, so I can't tell how well the perforation works. But just to give you an idea, I know they kept saying these silkscreen logos save weight, but the jacket's still around a good eight pounds. So I don't know why they keep saying weight saving as a, it, was a, it wasn't really a dramatic weight saving. Um, the forearm protection feels very good. The back has a a good feel to it. I'm going to upgrade to the Alpine Stars back protector. And yeah, it's just a really good jacket. I'm really excited about it. It's a big upgrade over this uh, Joe Rocket textile jacket. I mean, as you can see, it did its job, but it was time to upgrade. So it matches well with the, uh, the boots and the leather pants that I got. All right. That's it.